Research has consistently shown that students perform better when they actively engage in reflection on their learning. According to John Dewey, one of the founding figures of modern education, we do not learn from experience. We learn from reflecting on experience. An Invisible Learning by John Hattie, he emphasizes that self-assessment and reflection are among the most impactful strategies in the learning process. When students assess where they are and what they need to improve, they gain clarity on their progress and can set more meaningful goals. With standards-based instruction and evidence-based grading, the goal is to develop student ownership within the proficiency-based model to monitor progress towards their enduring skills and success criteria. Students who understand the skill of self-grading are more accurate when predicting how they will perform on assessments. Students will reflect on, one, what is my proficiency level? Am I a four, three, two, or one? Two, am I proficient? If not, what success criteria do I need to improve on to be proficient? Three, what steps can I take to improve before the next assessment or reassessment? Integrating these reflective practices into daily routines, whether through formative or summative assessments, not only enhances academic skills, but also helps students build essential life skills like resilience, perseverance, and self-efficacy. This approach empowers students to take ownership of their learning, fostering a growth mindset where challenges are seen as opportunities to improve. As students become more adept at identifying their strengths and areas for improvement, they are better equipped to set realistic goals and take purposeful actions to meet or exceed proficiency. Over time, this process contributes to a deeper sense of autonomy and confidence, preparing students for long-term academic and personal success.